cooking in Run for it With Shane the Chef Ah, Maggie's not answering her phone Well, I'll ride over and get today's vegetables myself OK, Dad Whoa! Oops. <laughs> Sorry about that, Shane No problem, Sid Where are you off to? Out on every morning before school. It's a great way to get fit. You should try it. Oh, I'm pretty sure that running a busy restaurant keeps me in tip-top shape. Oh, ouch. <laughs> if you say so, Shane. By the way, you should put pasta on the menu so I can have it before I train. It's great for energy. See ya. Come on, easy now. Whoa! Ah, watch out! Hi, Maggie. Be right with you, Shane. I hope. I found the hay right where you said it would be. I didn't know you started keeping donkeys. I don't. Penny found this one when she was out on a nature walk with Honey and Jay. Why don't you take him to the local donkey sanctuary? Oh, we did but they don't have enough money to look after any more donkeys. Huh. I wonder if we can help. Ah! We could hold a sponsored run. I'm sure people would love to get involved. All we need is for someone to sign up first and get the ball rolling. Don't look at me. Well, what about you, Shane? Me? <laughs> <laughs> All right. OK. Hi, Dad. Has Mr Singh arrived to start your training? Yeah, I'm expecting him now. Where are you off to? It's still early. Me and Honey are going to collect sponsors before people go to work. See you later. Morning, Shane. One training partner is arranged. Let's go. OK. Easy does it. Come on, Shane, you can do it. Woo! Come on, knees up. Woo! I can't get my breath. Would you like a donut? Oh, thanks, Mama Polenta. Jane, stop. Huh? Donuts won't help you run. Remember what I said? You should eat things like pasta. Oh, surely just one won't hurt. Sizzling oh, no. saucepans. Stop. Thief. Oi, come back here. Oi, Jolly, come back. Oh, what's Jolly got? That bird's been getting training tips from Sid. <laughs> Not many people know this, but in my youth, before I took to the sea, I was quite the athlete. I remember me old mum saying... Why don't you sign up for the sponsored run, then? No, that's not what my old mum said. Uh... Oh, right. <laughs> So I've got pasta in tomato and basil sauce. Pasta? Sid says pasta's good for energy when you're running long distances. Ooh. Oh, that's right tasty, that is. Perfect pasta. What other foods are good for an athlete in training? Well, Mr Singh gave me a list. Oh, hello. OK, potato, fish, beans, duh. But it's a very long list. So? Let's get cooking and training.
your best time yet. Right. I think we're ready, Sam. Yeah! The race will begin shortly. Donkey, stop it. <laughs> this is it, Izzy. Excited? You bet. Children, to the start line, please. This should be no trouble. Better do some stretching. Ready to race. On your marks. Get set. Go! You're not in the race. <laughs> Are the adults ready? OK, guys. Try to keep up. Good luck, Maggie. And you. Good luck. This reminds me of the time I set a new school running record. On your marks. Get set. Go! Oh, oh, the run is started! Oh, wait for me! What did I just tell you? Oh, no! Slow down. Oh, oh slow down. Oh. Come back here, Donkey! Oh. 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 Oh, sorry, Sam. Excuse me. Oh. I'm so tired. I'm going to have a break. Mmm, ham and tomato. Thank you, Mama. Shane, Maggie, watch out! <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Uh, where's Sam got to? Oh, I don't know. OK, you carry on. I'm going to go back and check he's OK. Coming through, Sid! Oh. Donkey, slow down! He's finally stopped. Sam, Ooh. what are you doing back oh. here? Go on without me, Shane. The old sea legs have let me down. Come on, Sam. We trained for this run together, so that's how we'll finish it. Rejoa. Where's the donkey? Look, there he is. Oh, and your mum and Mario. <laughs> oh, we made it! Oh, yeah! <laughs> yes! yes! <laughs> oh, I did it! Yay! Come on, Sam, you can do it. Now you stay here this time. <sighs> Oh, 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 oh. Ah, yeah, well done, Sam. Thanks, Shane. I guess there is life in these old sea legs yet. <laughs> of course there is, Sam. All those healthy meals really helped us train. And they were lovely. And the winner of the adult run is Penny C. <laughs> Attention, everyone. Good news! We have raised enough money to get a place for Donkey at the local sanctuary. Give yourselves a chip. Yay! Yay! We did it! I couldn't have done it without you, Sam. Hooray! And let's hear it for Donkey. <gasps> He's not there. Um, where is he? Oh, I... I thought I tied him up. Uh... <gasps> oh, dear. Not again. <laughs> Please stop. Donkey, slow down. Let's get cooking in Izzy's Marvellous Marrow. With Shane the Chef. Ah, there we are. All nice and clean. Ready for the county show. I can't wait. Oh, I really hope my marrow wins the best vegetable competition. Morning, you two. Oh, <laughs> look out. It's a talking turnip. <laughs> oh, there you go. Turnips, carrots and sweet. Enough to feed everyone at the show. <laughs> and perfect for my very veggie stew. 
How's my marrow looking, Maggie? Same as yesterday, and the day before, and the day before that. Oh, you've spent so much time looking after that marrow, I thought you were going to move in. <laughs> Fancy giving me a hand to get everything ready for the show? Can I, Dad? Yeah, of course, Izzy. Everything's under control here. Come on, then. Let's go. Bye. Let's get, uh, peeling. This is going to be a very long job. Morning, Shane. Wow, looks like someone's preparing for the Vegetable Olympics. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think this peeler's going to be winning a gold medal. Ooh, that gives me an idea. I'll be right back. Uh... Your raspberries look lovely, Maggie. Try one. Mmm, these are great. They'll win first prize for the best fruit, for sure. As long as Jolly doesn't get to them first. <laughs> Show Jolly! Off you go! Get out! Get out of it! Come on! Dear me. Wow! Is that your pumpkin for the best vegetable competition? It's bigger than my marrow. Uh, maybe. But the judges will be looking at all kinds of things, Izzy. Hey. Why don't you give it a last polish while I load up the van? Good idea. Come on, Marrow. You can grow. Uh. Ah, better get my skates on. No need for skates. Not with my magnificent pronto peeler. Sizzling saucepans. Wow. <laughs> I mean, what? Just pop your veggies in here and let the pronto peeler do the rest. Uh, OK. Well, <laughs> let's give it a go. To you, Eddie. What? Whoops! Hey, be careful. Oh, are you OK? Sorry, Izzy. <laughs> What's that? And why are you talking to it? It's my marrow. I'm trying to make it grow bigger in time for the show, but it doesn't seem to be working. What's a marrow? It's a vegetable, Mario. You know, my mama sometimes sings to her flowers to make them grow. We could try that. OK, let's give it a try. Oh, lovely marrow, please grow for Izzy. If she doesn't win a prize, she'll get in a tizzy. Mario. Pumpkin! Phew, that was close. Ugh. Uh, Eddie! OK, let's get pronto peeling. Ooh, it's working! <laughs> wow! There you go, what did I tell you? Come on, go on, try some more. OK! It's definitely getting more sunshine like this. But it's not getting any bigger. Are you sure marrows taste nice? I'd rather have a raspberry. Leave those alone! Hey, go on, get off, you naughty thing! Don't worry, Maggie. I'll get him. I'm the best goalie in town. Oh, watch it, Mario. Oh. Ah! <sighs> oh, watch out! Ouch! Oh, good save, Izzy! Time we were off to the show before my pumpkin ends up as mash. At this rate, we'll be done in no time. Brilliant! Oh dear! Is it supposed to be that loud? Oh well. It probably just needs a tweak. Look out! My Mary looks like it has a good chance of winning. Oh, Mr. Singh started judging. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Wait. Where's Dad got to now? He wanted to see my marrow being judged. Dad, Mr. Singh's about to judge my... Uh. It's OK, Izzy. Don't panic. 
Everything's under control. But your veggie stew? What are you going to feed everyone now? Don't worry, Izzy. I'll think of something. Whoa! Now that's what I call a mess. Izzy, Mr Singh's about to judge your marrow. I know. I really wanted to see it. But I want to stay and help Dad. No, you go. I'll be fine. Oh, but Dad, how are you supposed to feed everyone? Off you go. And good luck. <gasps> good colour. Even flesh. Lovely tongue. I think he likes it. Yeah, but I really hope Dad's all right. Ooh. The marrow! Go for the marrow! The marrow! That's it! Sorry, Mr oh. Singh, but I'm going to need this. Uh, uh, uh. Here, Izzy, let me help. Uh, it's going to take more than that to feed everyone. Will this help, Dad? I can't use your marrow. What about the competition? Uh, I changed my mind. Do you think you can make my marrow into something tasty? Hmm. I know just the thing. You need to get tweaking, JG. Let's get cooking! And tweaking! You did it. Hooray! Hooray! Congratulations! <laughs> yes, indeed. A pumpkin to be proud of. Oh, thanks. But what did Izzy want with her marrow? Roll up, roll up for Izzy's marvellous marrow spaghetti. With very veggie sauce. Marrow spaghetti? <laughs> oh, yes, it's easy. Just get your marrow. Chop it up and pop it through the spiralizer. <laughs> Shane, I didn't know you had a spiralizer. He didn't. Mm, well, not until I gave the pronto peel and a tweak. It makes great vegetable spaghetti. See? Oh, mm. oh, Shane, it's a delicious. Almost as good as Mama's pasta. Mario, what? I said almost. Hey, Sid. <clears throat> After some thought, I have decided that Izzy should share the first prize with Maggie for sharing her marrow with everyone. But what about your pumpkin? Oh, Izzy, I wouldn't have a pumpkin if you hadn't saved it from Mario's football skills. Hey, my ball skills are the best. Watch. Uh, look at this. What? What? Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, I've got it. Oh, <laughs> another good save, Izzy. Here you go, Mario. Enjoy. Maybe you're the best goalie in town, Izzy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mario. Wow, honey, your self-portrait looks so cool. Thanks, Izzy. I'm sure yours will be great too. Yeah, I hope so. We just need the last few portraits and we can open the art exhibition to the public. Oh. Hello? Oh, yes? We'd be honoured. At what time? Yes, of course, I understand. Yes, we'll be ready. Goodbye. Who was it, Mum? Mr Picasso, the art critic, is coming here in just a few hours' time. Mr. Who? He's a famous art critic. A good review from him guarantees success for the exhibition. What does that mean? It means lots of people coming to see our pictures. But we're not ready! Jane Marriott is still working on their pictures 
and I haven't even started mine yet. OK, don't worry, Izzy. Let's see how they're getting on. I can't do it. Keep going, Mario. Everyone could be creative if they try. Hm, I don't think so. Hey, guess what? An art critic is coming to see our portraits in just a few hours. Ooh, that's impressive. Sounds like you'd all better get cracking then. Oh, it's no good! I can't do a portrait. I don't know how. Don't worry. Why don't you try paints instead? Perhaps that's more your thing. Um, OK. Go on. Give it a try. You might surprise yourself. Uh, oh. Don't mind me. You carry on. No rush. Well, maybe just a bit of one. Penny. Seeing as you're waiting anyway and Izzy is busy, how about helping me in the kitchen? I'm sorry, Shane, but I'm not much of a cook. Everyone can cook with a little practice. <laughs> Give it a try. You might surprise yourself. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, right then. <laughs> doesn't look anything like me. There we go. All the ingredients we need to make the best pizzas. Wholemeal flour, olive oil, yeast, water, a little salt and sugar for the dough, tomatoes and lots of tasty vegetables for the toppings. Goodness me, where do we start? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll show you. So, what kind of pizza would you like to make? Um, honey pizza? Um, I'm not sure honey is quite right for a pizza, but we've got plenty of other toppings to choose from. I did warn you, I'm not very good at all this. You'll be brilliant. Just copy me. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Get your hands in there and mix everything up together. Now, we knead the dough like this. Ugh. No, you've got to show it who's boss. OK, here goes. That's it. Uh, uh, um, Shane. Ah! I'm not sure this one's any better than the last one. Oh, it looks good to me. And me. Really? Great. And that is how you make a thin pizza base. Go on, Penny, give it a go. OK. Oh, no. Ooh. I uh, think it's time to move on to the toppings. <laughs> 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 it's looking really good, Mario. Mum was right. Pain is definitely your thing. Yeah, maybe you're right. Right, so you put the sauce on like this. Sizzling saucepans. <laughs> How marvellous. <laughs> um, maybe I should have mentioned... The toppings go on the pizza, not the chef. <laughs> Finished! Me too! Almost done. Yours looks great! Whoa, really cool. Thanks. Just need to add a little... Oh, water! Oh, Mario! Mine's ruined! Mine too! Ah! Mario? Mario? Oh! Mario, what's happened? It's my fault. I've ruined everything. It can't be that bad. It is. Look. It'll be OK. Maybe there's time for you to redo your pictures. Mum, what happened to you? I've been making pizza. Are you the pizza? <laughs> <laughs> Was that you? Yes. I'm starving. Hmm. 
Dad, are there lots of pizza ingredients left? Yeah. And if you're thinking what I think you're thinking, that's a great idea. OK, everyone, let's get cooking. Penny, the exhibition looks great. <gasps> Mum, Mr. Picasso's arrived. Uh oh. <gasps> <gasps> Mr. Picasso, welcome to our exhibition. Allow me to. Picasso oh. prefers to experience every exhibition as if it is his first. Uh. Oh. Oh, interesting. Mm. I think I prefer the frame. Oh, hey! Mm. Oh. Oh. oh, yes. Oh, what do we have here? Such multimedia intertextuality. Hmm. What's he talking about? You experience them with your eye, your nose, and your tongue. What did he just say? <laughs> no idea. And now, Picasso must write the review. He didn't hang about. His review's already on the website. What's it say? What's it say? A magnificent exhibition showing off some amazing new local talents. Oh, what a relief. And the highlight of the exhibition was the inspired collection of stunning portrait pizzas. <laughs> Woo! Yay! Yay! Brilliant! still think mine's the best. But does that mean we can't eat those pizzas now that they're art? Mm, I'm afraid so, Mario. Oh, I'm starving. Well, I can solve that. Ta-da! Dad, it's you. Yep. Oi, you want a piece of me? <laughs> yes, yes, please. please. Yeah. Thanks, Dad. Good texture. Lovely smell. Yum. Exquisite taste. Maybe I do like art after all. Especially when it tastes this good. It's a master pizza! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone, tuck in. Let's get cooking in Shane's World Record. With Shane the Chef. Check this out. Oh, you do, honey. Where'd you learn to do that? <laughs> I taught myself. You'll go, Jay. Here we go. Yeah! Whoa! Oh, did you see that? Who's next? Here you go, Dad. Ah, oh, thanks, Izzy. Five tins, no problem. Right, here I go. Oh, <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! Oh! Ah! Oh! <gasps> It's OK, Izzy. I'm fine. Huh? I bet you didn't know I could skateboard. <laughs> uh, I still don't. Thank you. Tony Gole is the world's greatest skateboarder. He just made a world record jump. He jumped over five tins of tomatoes? Uh, no. Ten monster trucks. <laughs> <sighs> it must be brilliant to break a world record. Hello there, Shane. Izzy. Hi, JG. Ooh, a skateboard slalom. I'll give it a go. Well, hey! Wow! Cool moves, JG. Thanks. I was just wondering, any chance of one of your delicious cheese salad sandwiches, Shane? Absolutely, JG. Coming right up. 
<sighs> I'd love to break a world record. Maybe the world's tallest sandwich. Uh, I wonder. Dad, JG was wondering where his sandwich was. Huh? No worries, is it? It's right here. Oh, whoa! Oh! Oh, Dad. I uh, ran out of sliced bread, so I made you a cheese salad baguette instead. That okay? Ah, <laughs> uh, thanks, Shane. It's a bit bigger than I was expecting. That's it? What's it? A sandwich! A really big, record-breaking sandwich! Oh, boy. OK, so we need to make a really big bread maker. Dad, I phoned the world record people. They're sending a judge down tomorrow. Tomorrow? But we're not ready. Oh, don't panic, Shane. Help me put this together and we'll have you baking in no time. Well, what about the ingredients? I haven't prepared anything. Don't worry, Dad. I'm on it. Sam, can you help? Dad needs ingredients for a world record sandwich. A world record sandwich? Sure. I've got crab, tuna and some juicy prawns. Thanks, Sam. Hi, Maggie. What's that, Izzy? A world record sandwich? Uh, lettuce, tomatoes and cucumbers, that kind of thing. OK, no problem. Thanks, Maggie. We'll also need plenty of flour to make the bread. I'll get the windmill turning. See you tomorrow. So I was wondering if you could spare any honey. For a world record? Of course. Thank you. Mama Polenta, can you help Dad? We need some ingredients for his world record sandwich. A world record? Oh, of course I'll help. Ingredients are sorted, Dad. How's a... Oh, wow! Hiya, Izzy. Isn't she a beauty? Going for a test run in three, two, one. Are you sure this is going to work? Absolutely. <laughs> it just needs a bit of a tweak. There, all fixed now. I'm starving! Oh, oh. oh, please. Oh, there you go, Shane. That's the last one. Thanks, Maggie. Ready, JG? Ready? It works! Oh! <laughs> I told you it would. Right, let's get baking. Go flour. And go water. Go yeast. Go salt. It's working! It's actually working! I hope we're not too late. I want to see Shane baking the sandwich. Me too. Oh, I want to still be in bed. Wow, look! <laughs> Just look at that. Morning, everyone. Well done, Shane. Thanks, Penny. Oh, it's a whopper, Shane. Almost as big as that muddy eel I caught when I was a kid. <laughs> right, everyone, I think we're ready to start. OK, I'll put the brake on. Is this Munchington? I've come to judge a world record sandwich. Yes, it is. But sorry, the sandwich isn't quite ready yet. No matter, in your own time. OK, everybody. It's sandwich time! How's my dad doing? 
I can't say officially until the sandwich is complete, but unofficially, it's looking very good. Very good indeed. We shouldn't be too much longer. Sizzling saucepan. <gasps> Dad! <gasps> Watch out! Oh, it's out of control! Where are you going? Oh, no! Okay. Come on! Ooh. Whoa, help! Izzy! Oh, no! Wait, wait, wait! Ah! Oh. 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 Never catch it! Ooh. Whoa, it's out of control! I'm out of control! Whoa, 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 watch out! Giant sandwich coming through! Oh. Okay, okay, uh, what would Tony Gold do? Uh, careful! Ah! Ah! I think I've got the hang of this! Oh no! Ah. Ah. Wait, wait, wait! Whoa! <laughs> ah! Is he help me? Whoa, 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 watch out! Skateboarding now, just like Tony Gull. Put the brake on, Ooh. Shane! Okay, yeah, I'm trying, it's difficult. Oh no, okay, I've got it, I've got it. He's oh, heading oh, for the oh, harbour. Oh. Ah. Dad! Oh, watch, watch out! Watch out! Ah. <gasps> Dad! Oh, no. Shane! Dad! Well, I'll be. Don't worry, I'm fine. And so's the sandwich. That's the strangest catch me and the merry mackerel have ever caught. <laughs> it was a shame there's not a record for that, Sam. Oh, delicious. Mmm, bravo! That is good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I love it. So, did we break the record? Unfortunately, in all the excitement, I was unable to take the required measurements, so I can't say that you made the world's biggest sandwich. Oh, no! Oh, oh dear! Oh. Oh. oh, after all that work! But I can tell you that you now hold the world record for the world's fastest sandwich! <laughs> Woohoo! Hey! Everyone, it's a new world record! Oh, Yay. Yes! Wonderful! On, oh, well done, Dad! Back of the oven! Let's get cooking in Marvin's Marvelous Mangoes. With Shane the Chef! Here it is, a lovely salad, tasty and delicious. Everybody ready? Oh! Oh! Almost ready! Why is it so quiet in here? It's not quiet out there. Look! And the scientific name for this magnificent specimen oh, is wow. Magnifera indica, otherwise known as the Mighty Mango. Amazing! Wow. Hey, what's going on? It's Marvin. Uh, and my magnificent mangoes. Mango? That's a fruit, right? That's right, Mario. A fruit. But so much more. This mango is loaded with vitamins, minerals... And antioxidants. Anti-what? Yeah, stuff that's good for you. Why didn't he just say that? Well, some chefs like to overcomplicate things. <laughs> ah, there you go. <laughs> now, that's what I call the real skill. Wow! Absolutely wow. And it tastes delicious! Mmm, tasty. <laughs> Oh, hello, Marvin. I'm Shane. That's my restaurant over there. Fresh. Pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you, Shaney boy. Whoops. Whoop. Ah. Ha. There you go. Ooh, wow. Amazing. Neat trick. Yeah, I do a spinny thing like that with my spoon. Watch. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Hang on. Whoa. Whoa. Bear with me. Whoa. Oh, no. <laughs> Just dropped it again. Silly me. Butterfingers. Whoa. Best of three. Here we go. Whee. Ta-da. <laughs> Oh, where's he gone? Right, three mangoes, Amazing. up in the air. Now, that's what I call real skill. Uh, Shane, what are you thinking? I'm thinking I know a thing or two about mangoes. 
Marvin might put on a good show, but look what I've got. Mangoes from the deli, milk from Maggie's cow, and some good old fashioned Shane the Chef know-how. You know what that adds up to? What? Delicious mango ice cream, my friend. Ice cream? Great! But won't it take ages to freeze? Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> yes, of course. What you need is one of my amazing inventions. I'll be right back. And now, ladies and gentlemen, feast your eyes on this high-tech gadget. A state-of-the-art compressor, a vacuum port, and a digital thermometer. This little baby is a chef's best friend. <laughs> wow. Dad. Just whisking up some ice cream for the crowd outside. But isn't that going to take a long time? Not if we use this. It just needs a little tweak. And it's a lean, mean ice cream machine. Yeah, but how fast will it freeze? You know your gadgets don't always... See you later, Shane. Work. The compressor goes whoosh. And through the miracle of science... Hey, everybody, come on in. Shane's serving up some fantastic mango ice cream. Ooh. Awesome. Yummy. Huh? Mango ice cream, eh? OK, everybody, gather round. Look at this mango. Hmm, so fresh. Now, just pour the ingredients in here. You have tested this, haven't you, JG? It'll be fine, Shane. Uh, is it supposed to do that? It'll be fine, Addy. Ah! Ah! Sizzling saucepans! Oh, I no. don't think it was supposed to do that. Uh, sorry. Um, this should cheer you up. Oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> sorry. Uh, it's Marvin. Sorry, Shane. Here we go. Sorry, Shane. Sorry, Dad. <sighs> oh. Wow. Liquid nitrogen, my friends. <laughs> Cooling these mango slices to a temperature of minus 196 degrees Celsius. That's cold, right? Super cold. Super, super cold. Super mega scientifically cold. <laughs> Don't try this at home, kids. Coconut milk, vanilla, and of course, marvelous mango. <laughs> Liquid nitrogen is so cold, within seconds, we have mango ice cream! Yay! <laughs> that is the best mango ice cream I've ever tasted. That's the only mango ice cream you've tasted. <laughs> oh, yum! Oh. Mmm, oh. Shane, I think your mango ice cream's wonderful. It's not as popular as Marvin's. <laughs> Uh. Oh, poor Shane. Oh, you always make me look so good. Oh, no. Well, I think this is good ice cream. It's great ice cream. Not as great as liquid nitrogen and big wishy clouds of steam. You don't need wishy clouds of steam, Dad. You're just, um, you know, you. And that's good enough. Yeah. <sighs> Shane, you listen to Mama. You are the chef who needs no wash. Everybody loves you. And why? Because you are like a big, strong tomato. Huh? Tomatoes come from the dirt, yes? Dirty tomatoes. But put them on a pizza and everyone cheers. Hooray for the tomato. And that's you, Shane. Shane the tomato. <laughs> and don't you ever forget it. Mama, you're right. She is. she is. I'm a tomato. And tomatoes don't quit. Right, Mama Polenta? The tomato never quits. I'm going to go out there and offer to help Marvin. And maybe I can learn some new tricks along the way. Hey, Marvin, you've probably got a lot of hungry, excited customers coming your way. So, can I give you a hand? You want to help me? Yeah, sure. And maybe you can teach me a few new tricks. Do you know how to fix a liquid nitrogen machine? That would be a good trick. Um, no. Didn't think so. Bye. 
What are you doing? I'm leaving town, mate. Wait, Marvin, you can't leave. Sorry, but my machine's broken. And without my machine, I can't give people what they want. You can make other stuff with mangoes, can't you? Well, uh, yeah. I mean, no. I mean, mango ice cream's really my speciality. Anyway, it's the machinery and the show that draws a crowd. Marvin, you're wrong. It's the food that draws the crowd, and great food is what keeps people coming back for more. Have you ever tried Mango Salad Supreme? Uh, no. OK, so I use the mangoes. Yeah? I also use lettuce, avocado. OK. Mint. Ah, oh, mint. Grilled prawns. Seriously? And peanuts. Peanuts? Shay, you're a genius. Nuts. I love it. Want to give it a try? I certainly do. Then, let's get cooking! Mango Salad Supreme. Wow, Shane. I'm impressed. Brilliant. <laughs> yum. Definitely yum. Mango is my new favourite thing. Ooh, I am so proud of my tomato. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Mama Polenta. This salad is mango-tastic. And, by the way, I hope you don't mind, but a bolt was loose on your compressor, so I tightened it. Should work fine now. Thanks, JG. Cheers, mate. Hey, everyone, we're back in business. Look at that. Amazing. Who wants ice cream? Woohoo! Thanks, Shane. You taught me something today. Even without my gadgets, that was one of the best meals I ever made. You come back and visit sometime. You know what? I will. And here, some liquid nitrogen. You never know. Oh, uh, th thanks. Goodbye, Shane. Bye, Marvin. I think you've made a new friend, Dad. Yeah. I think I have, is he? I think I have. Let's get cooking in... No Go-Kart. With Shane the Chef. Hiya. Hi, Maggie. Wow. Did you make that all by yourself, Izzy? Yes. Dad started me off, but he's really busy with the restaurant. <laughs> that sounds like Shane. He must be planning something special for after the go-kart race. Ta-da! Lamb and vegetable kebabs in a rosemary marinade. Mmm. Is that what all these veggies are for? Ah, yes, let me check. Courgettes, peppers, tomatoes and onions. That's the lot. Thanks for dropping them off, Maggie. I'm preparing everything early so I can help Izzy with her go-kart. Then it's kebabs for everyone after the race. Nice car, Izzy. Any special features? Uh, I wasn't planning any. How about you? We've designed it so it's really aerodynamic, haven't we, Dad? Yeah. A aerodynamic? Streamlined, so the cart goes faster. See you at the starting line. Bye. <sighs> I see you've got your kebab skewers out ready, Shane. Yep, and once these courgettes are chopped, I'll just need to make a rosemary marinade for the lamb. You are organised today. Gotta be, if I'm going to help Izzy and serve kebabs to everyone later. Well, make sure you save me one. <laughs> right, I'd better get everyone ready for the race. See you later, Shane. Bye. Now, I just need the rosemary. There should be plenty in Izzy's herb pots. Right, uh, driver Izzy and, uh, oh, what's the name of your cart? Um, how about Fresh and Simple? Fresh and Simple? Ha, I like it. Hello, Izzy. Mmm, making a go-kart, are you? Yeah, do you like it? Mm, looks stable enough, but I could think of a few things that could be tweaked. Well, I'm trying to keep things simple. Oh, no! Izzy! Sorry, JG. Gotta go. Bye, Izzy. Mm. 
go-karts. Interesting. The rosemary doesn't look very happy, is he? What do you think is wrong with it? That's odd. It's soaking wet. I've been watering it every day for you. Is that not good? I think it's got root rot. Rosemary plants like dry soil. Oh. I'm sorry, Izzy. That's OK, Dad. We can still save it if I dry the soil out. But it's no use for today. What are we going to do about your marinade? Well, I'll give Maggie a call. I think she has a rosemary bush. What's the name of your cart? My cart's called the Busy Bee. Thanks, honey. And mine's the Atomic Rocket. Dad helped me get it aerodynamic. <laughs> oh, that's my phone. Hello, Shane. Yeah? Yeah, of course. There's a huge rosemary bush next to my house. Take as much as you like. Oh, but you better hurry. The race will be starting soon. Can you get the car up to the start line, Izzy? I'll join you as soon as I've got that rosemary. I'll just put these back in your toolbox first. Good thinking. On second thoughts, bring the whole toolbox up to the start line, just in case we need something. And don't worry, Izzy. I promise I'll be there to push you off. Toolbox, toolbox... Ah! Toolbox! Here we go. <sighs> Hi, Izzy. <sighs> Here, Izzy. There's room next to me. Thanks, Mario. Hold the start line, Maggie. Uh, uh, what have you got there, JG? My go-kart, of course. I, I didn't know you were racing, JG. When I saw how much fun Izzy was having putting her cart together, I didn't want to miss out. So I put this little thing together. That is all right, isn't it? Of course. The more the merrier. Fabulous. In that case, meet the Turbo <gasps> Auto Boost Mega Cart. <gasps> Drive boost, check. Steering wheel, check. Auto push off, check. Um, JG, what does this red button do? Uh, that's the emergency braking system, Jay, which I won't need because I can steer myself out of trouble. Oops! <laughs> Has anyone got a screwdriver? I have. You can use anything in here. Thanks, Izzy. Race starting any minute, JG. Hurry up! <gasps> that's plenty of rosemary. Time to get back. <laughs> Sizzling saucepans. Millie, I don't have time for this. Bring that back. One more tweak and... Oh, now the connector is broken too. Hmm. Perhaps there is something else in the toolbox I can use. What have we here? I could use these for precision steering control. Race starting any minute, JG. Oh, calamity! Give it to me. <laughs> Oh, finally. <laughs> you better not have made me late for the race, Millie. Starting positions, everyone. Wait for me. Ah, there. All fixed. Genius. Even if I do say so myself. 30 seconds to start time. But Dad's not here yet. Oh, I'm sorry, Izzy. But we can't wait any longer. <sighs> Dad! I'm here, I'm here. Don't worry, don't worry. <gasps> you made it! You ready for the big push, Izzy? Yes. 15 seconds! Check seat belts, helmets, on your marks. Get set. Here we go. Go! <laughs> here we go. Ah, watch out! Oh, 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 okay. oh, oh, are you all right, Dad? I'm fine. Just keep driving. Hurry up, Mario. Hey, that's not fair. Dad, your extra weight is speeding me up. Well, I'm glad to help. Yay! Oh, wow! Any faster. Ooh. I'm going to get you. <laughs> Quick. Izzy, Oh, here we go. Dad, this huh? is brilliant. Are we winning? Jay, watch out. Whoa. Left, right. No! My aerodynamics has failed me. How's it going out there? Amazing. Come on, JG. And... Oh! Dad, now swing right. Oh, you must go faster. Now swing left. What, like this? Come on, JG. Lean your legs the other way. Like this? Fantastic. Just a little to the left. 
Ooh, that wasn't meant to happen. I'm out of control. <laughs> Let's go turbo. Oh, that's the emergency brake. Oh. Woo, yay! Woo! Oh, yay! Dad, we won! Yay! Yes. Well done. So much for aerodynamics. What happened to JG's mega car? I'm not sure. I did overtake him. Oh. Are you okay, JG? I'm fine. Just my pride that's damaged. <gasps> Where did you get these from, JG? Oh, I made them from those old skewers you had in your toolbox, Shane. Sizzling saucepans! My kebabs! Thanks for helping, JG. Oh, it's the least I could do, Shane. If only I could find you some new skewers. Never mind. I'll just have to put everything in the oven and make a lamb and vegetable grill. That's probably enough rosemary for now. Right you are. What do you want to do with these sticks? Sticks? Rosemary sticks? Oh, thanks, JG. You've just saved the day. Me? Well, what did I do? I can use these rosemary sticks to make wooden kebab skewers. Nice and simple. Let's get cooking. Lamb and veggie kebabs. Mm hmm. Tuck in, everyone. Mmm, tasty. Mm. Mm. Delicious. Delicious and so simple. Just like Izzy's winning go kart. <laughs> Who's for another kebab? Oh, thanks, Shane. Very clever, Shane. Using the rosemary sticks to make the skewers. Ah, it was simple, really. And simple is best. Isn't it, JG? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I'll never live this down. <laughs> <laughs>